Okay. So, hello everybody. I am Tracy Winesaffle and I'm in my studio. My mom just said, cute top. So, if you are new, welcome. And if you are old, still welcome. Not old. Not, not old. I meant not new. <laughs> Andy's already rolling out the um, everything I'm about to say, so I can use her as a script. So I'd like to thank our moder moderators, which are Andy, Mary, and the Four Tops. No, Andy, Mary, and Lori. Those are the the back the doo -wop singers tonight. They're making everything run smoothly. And I am your monkey, your painting monkey. So I just paint for the next hour. And um, if you're new, please step up. If you're a guest and you're not logged in, you can't participate in the chat. And, oh, Dad, I have to show. My dad just said it's wine o'clock. So, Dad, look at the gift I got from Mary. It says it's wine 30. Isn't that funny? And Sheila is back in Florida. Awesome. So, everybody's a little bit closer. And I have napkins that um, say it's wine 30. Isn't that cool? Okay. I, it's, they're so cool that they're sitting right there. And I was just telling everybody, I am on a little mission to lose eight pounds by Thanksgiving. So, as Mary said, especially today. I can't have a glass of wine until uh, after the show. Uh, otherwise, it just makes things a little more interesting. But, um, and I do have one after the show, and I will. Uh, but I was telling everybody I'm trying to lose eight pounds by Christmas because I've just let things get a little bit out of whack. But I've got my life back in balance, so now i got to get my food back in balance. So I'm back to like eight glasses of water, eating vegetables, and cooking better, and eating controlled meals. Like I'm not, you know, just sitting down and eating whenever I feel like it. And tonight starts the I cannot have a snack past 8 o'clock, which means I'm going to be miserable. I love to get in bed with snacks <laughs> and read my book. So, um, uh, so right after the show, it's wine 30 for me. And in, right now it's tea 30. I'm having a tea in my favorite mug and I'm finishing my like eighth glass of water. So last week y'all got to witness me running to go tinkle in the last 10 minutes and I'm hoping I can make it through a whole hour. Okay. And look at Spaz 1958 says I can do it. Eight pounds is nothing for me. I actually fluctuate 10 pounds in weight, but I'm on the other end of the 10 pounds where my pants don't fit and I cannot afford a new a wardrobe. So this is what you do. You either lose the eight pounds. Yeah. By Thanksgiving. It'll all probably, everybody just said dark chocolate is okay. I have that. Thank you mom for saying I look great, but you know, when you don't feel great, I know I don't look different 10 pounds last. Maybe I do because I'm noticing there's a certain angle that does not look good for me. But anyway, um, I'm at peace with that. It's just, uh, you know, when you don't feel great and your pants don't fit, it's no fun. When you're doing the dance to get on the bed, okay, to get in your pants, okay, say hello. Hi. Okay. No. <laughs> Take veggies. Okay, two. I agree with mom. You look great. Oh, thank you, honey. Okay, hey, bye -bye. no, I don't. Okay, okay, bye bye. Okay, that was one of the glue dots. That's one of my twins. It's my daughter, Michaela. Okay, so in preparation for tonight, I wrote down four quotes. I don't even have a printer because I ran out of ink. It's on its way. And then I cut out, I had these, uh, I think they were from Rusty Pickle 100 years ago, but I never used them. They're, they're letters uh, out of uh, cardboard, corrugated cardboard. So I cut out the word love, and that's all I've done so far. So this is a kind of go-as-you-flow kind of night, and I'm going to use some acrylics, and I don't know what I'm going to do with them, as usual. <laughs> it's my norm. Um, so that's about it. That, any questions before we start? I love, I love somebody just says, I also use my pants as a gauge. We have two choices. I go out and buy a new wardrobe, which would feel great, but not be good on my expense and my budget. Or I just go back to the, losing the eight pounds and feeling good. Okay. Everybody's saying hello. Goodbye. 
So that's what I've done in preparation tonight. If there's any requests, you may um, bring them up now if you want to see something. But more than likely, I'm probably going to say, sorry, it doesn't work. No, I'm teasing. I'm not going to say that. Okay. So I welcome everybody. I am going down the list here real quick. Angel Painter, Brenda, Terry. I know. Shauna Ray, Sarah, Create and Sarah. Deborah, Jean is in Michigan. I know that. Pam, uh, Melissa Dodge in Canada. Look at me. I feel like I'm just running down the list. Mary is our moderator. Inky Fingers, Glue Mom, Good Glue Dad. They are the one who made glue me. Thank you very much. Appreciate that. Um, I love this. Wow. I, a lot of new names. Vicky is here. Please. Uh, Sheila is here. Sheila is now in Florida. Welcome, Sheila, to the States again. Uh, Sandy Beach, all the way in Australia. RJP111. So if you're not logged in, I can't. Um, <laughs> my dad just said lose eight pounds and buy ink. Hold on. Okay. Lose eight pounds buy ink. God, I wish I could buy losing eight pounds and I could <laughs> lose the ink. Okay, Mary Kay. Mary Kay is here. So Angie is here. Wow. Oh my goodness. Okay, so great. Great, great, great. So we're going to start. Uh, that's it. That's our start. Here we go. Deb. Oh, Angel. Deb is Angel Painter. Good. I love all the angles. What is she talking about? <laughs> okay. Uh, tonight you have wicked blue eyes. Oh, you know what I think it is? I think it's my darker hair, which everybody, I thank you so much for saying you love it, which is cracking me up because everybody's saying, we're so used to you being, you know, your natural blonde self. <laughs> I hate to break it to people, but none of that blonde was ever natural. <laughs> I know. So anyway, God, you guys, I wish I could crap my eight pounds off. Don't you wish you could just lose weight? Like, you know. So anyway, and I thought I would change this up a little bit and like, okay, really what I wanted to do was incorporate this in my background somehow, but I really have to commit to a, um, really going to have to commit to a title if I do that. And I want to do this. I don't know if you noticed what I'm doing. I want, there we go. I want to expose the corrugated part of it. Does that make sense? I don't want to just have flat, boring letters. I could make flat boring letters okay so we're gonna go with love tonight I guess which probably is not one of my did anybody see go to my blog today I posted my um, um, I posted my Halloween costume from the weekend I went to a party an adult party you know with no kids and um, it's always interesting to go Halloween has anybody ever been Halloween shopping for a costume for an adult it's kind of like walking, you know, saying, hi, I'd like to buy a stripper outfit. And I'm a 43-year-old mom of three kids. So uh, let me just tell you, my son, Joey, was like, you know, no, mom, you cannot, you know, pretty much vetoed everything that I was trying to come up with. And I ended up going as a skeleton. I wore a tank top. It was cute. You know, it wasn't over the top disgusting. But I don't know if you guys have tried to buy a Halloween costume in your latter years versus when you were a kid where every even the teenage see my daughter is still in the age of innocence I have her for a few more years she doesn't want to show her midriff yes okay I'm not making these perfect but I just want to without ripping the letter up I guess we're going with love so anyway, I went to a Halloween party this weekend, had a really great time, and the funny thing was, I was sleeping on their couch in their garage by my normal bedtime. <laughs> Pretty much take me to a party. My girlfriend was texting me, uh, where are you? I fell asleep. I know. I'm so boring. I had a great time, though. I did. Don't get me wrong. Okay. I guess this is going to be the whole entire show. We're just going to watch me rip these cardboard letters up. <laughs> I know it's going to be. So I know Anna Robin was tuning in with her friends tonight, and they went shopping, and she asked, texted me. And so if Anna Robin is here and can raise her little hands, um, she's painting with some friends. So I told her, oh, crud, I got it. They're really trying. She's like, we're trying this. She is a super creative card person, you know, made cards and scrapbooking and 
So it's really cool to see that. And I'm going to be doing a piece for her, so it's to hang on her wall. Which I better hurry, because if she's painting, she's probably going to be like, I can paint my own piece and hang it on my wall. Anyway. I really am trying to distress these letters, but as I'm trying to do this, I'm getting distressed. So I'm thinking that maybe um, the word distress is perfect here. <laughs> okay, yeah, I'm feeling distressed. Anyway, so that's what I did this week. And I went to a Halloween party with a bunch of adults, was sleeping on the couch by my normal bedtime, and didn't get home till nearly 2.33 o'clock in the morning. So guess what I did all day Sunday? I slept. See, it's not like when you're, when you're in your 20s and you could go out and go to class the next morning at 8 o'clock in the morning or, you know, go to work. No. Oh, and if you guys are noticing my nails, it was part of my costume. Look at how long I grew my nails into daggers. They're all being cut tonight. I figured uh, I painted them orange and then I, I put black, whatever that crackle nail polish was. So it looks like I have evil nails. I really don't. It's C. I do, but okay. So that's good enough. I'm going to glue these babies down, and they're going to be, I'm going to glue them in the word. And we're going to commit to where the title is, because now I'm stuck with it once I glue it down. And this is it. So this is going to be it. <laughs> Look at me. I literally wrote, lose eight pounds by ink. Thanks, Dad. And how are we going to glue this? With some glue. Good idea. This glue is not open. Let's find some glue that is open. Okay. <sighs> okay. So somebody was asking if I'm back in balance, which I thought was funny because last week I talked about being all out of whack. But I am happy to report that um, nothing has changed. I'm still as busy, but I'm just not doing saying yes to as many things. Doesn't that feel good? Okay. So all I'm doing is painting this because, I don't know, somehow in the mix of all this, this is, uh, okay. I want this in my background. We'll figure out how to bring it out. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I guess I have to glue this down right here. There we go. Goody, goody. Uh, okay, there we go. There's our whole piece for tonight. That's all. We're, we're done. If you're logging in, you missed the entire show, you should be here on time. Oh, use an exacto knife. Thanks, Dad. Done. Mr. Helpful tonight. Lose eight pounds by ink. Okay. Okay, so this is kind of a, you know, it's an inspiring piece. It's uh, a very plain piece. No. I am just going to shove some color on here. I really wish I had some sp empty spray bottles. I meant to go in the attic today. And, oops, I'm not going to do that. I meant to go in the attic. I'm using Deco Art, and I just picked out some of my fave colors. I just, I don't know what I, is going to end up being on the page. But I really want to just slap the paint down and see where it goes kind of thing. I don't want to make nasty colors, though. So that's kind of important. Sometimes when you use, you know, color, you make some weird, ugly brown color. I'm not into that today. At least I'm, that's not the attempt. Okay. So here we go. I need my water bottle. Check, check, check. Where is it? Oh, here it is. Okay. And I think what I'm going to do is just to make this easy, do some blotting of some color with just my, and you know, I don't know, I never know with the background what's going to happen to it. I don't even know with these letters if I'm going to have to gesso them up. So I'm just going to, I'm not going to worry about it for right now. And I am going to spray, oops. I am kind of starting to worry about it. If I continue to do what I'm doing, it's going to look like hell, but okay. I will tell you that Monday nights are about letting it go. So if something works here, this is kind of where I test it out. And if it doesn't work here, you know, I should probably just sew these letters. I think they'll kind of 
can perform better <laughs> if I do that. This is just gesso. In fact, I'm just going to do that. Okay. I think they'll, I think they'll blend. I think things will go better on them if they're gessoed. So I always say to you guys, I have a hard time, believe it or not, when I'm by myself, just letting it go. But Monday night is like, I have to let it go. So, um, somebody, somebody emailed me and said, where do I get my inspiration? Uh, I just put myself in a situation where if I do it wrong or it looks like crap, then, uh, you know, oops, that's a little thick on the gesso right there. Okay. I, I don't care. I, I actually want it to be all thick and chunky and fun. Um, I'm not, I don't know if I'm feeling these colors or not, but I don't know. We're feeling them now because here we go. We're committing to it. <laughs> kind of stuck now. Do, I, do we like these colors? Has anybody... Oh, shoot. You know what? I forgot my apron. Hey, thanks, guys. Oh, I am recording. <laughs> okay, I forgot my apron, which is kind of a necessary thing. Uh, and I forgot to roll up my sleeves. Again. Okay, apron is on. I bet you somebody said put your apron on. Okay. Oh, thank you for updating about the game. I... So what happens when your team loses, you become a little, okay, cool. I mean, I don't know. Cool, 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 kind of cool. And then I'm just going to spray this baby down. I don't know why, but I just feel it. I wish I had, this is a wet, I think it's a wet media or yeah, paper. So I have a little bit of play here with it. Okay. I love using water with acrylic. In fact, I usually take, and I, I don't have any empty spray bottles now because I took, I put them all upstairs with um, in the attic because I just finished a class and I thought, eh, I don't need those. But I kind of do because I want to mix some acrylic paints. Okay, cool. I really feel like I need a blue color in here. Oh, or a, this banana color to bring it back just a bit. Okay. Yeah, it does kind of look like fall. Okay, good point. Thank you. I'm not going to stress out over the... Okay, I'm just going to bring the color. This is like a banana. And anywhere I'm having white, I'm just going to go back in. And it is kind of fall. You know what? It is kind of fall. It is fall, too. So, I guess this is what I was feeling. So, everybody asks, you know, what was my inspiration? What was I working on? I don't really... Certainly don't practice for this. So... Okay, and I don't know, something has to happen down here with these letters or I'm going to go nuts. Okay, but in the end, I'll probably bring them out. Don't worry about that. All right. Ba -ba -bum. This kind of looks like fall. Got to clean up, got to clean up. I don't know why, but I do. If you guys don't work on one of these heat resistant type mats, I highly recommend it. I gotta roll up my sleeves a little bit more. I've got paint going all the way up my arm. Okay, there we go. This is a mixed media paper. In fact, I believe that they're gonna be, this is Strathmore and they're gonna be a sponsor next month, so stay tuned. Um, God, I don't know what I'm feeling right now. I know, I know kind of, you know what, this is kind of looking fall and kind of feeling fall. Um, so I'm going to kind of carry on with it because, because I am. I need a little more paint than that. Okay. 
Okay. All right. Cool. Cool. I'm going to give this a little zap of a dry because I sprayed all that water on it. Nope. Oh, there we go. Okay, I'm hearing rust letters. I'm not hearing, I'm reading. <laughs> You know what, I think we're going to go, I can't believe I'm saying this because I don't normally do fall and I don't, but I am loving the idea a little bit. And I must have been feeling fall because I'm painting with it. I believe the random colors I picked out. These are not my norm. I know. And I have a template in my mind, which I hope I can find. Do, do, do. Hmm. Here it is. I don't know why, but this is going to, I did leaves last week. Otherwise I do leaves again, but I really wanted to bring some turquoise in this. And I know you guys are going to all faint on me, but I really do want turquoise in here. So don't, oh, gold letters, copper, copper, ooh, oh, Andy, thanks for posting that, yes, please, the October challenge was sponsored by Grumbacher, if you could go to their Facebook page, that would be fabulous, okay, so I really am, um, oh, gold letters and antiquum, love it, okay, so hold on, Love it. Hold on. Let me see. Let me see. Because I do know. You sure gold or copper? Bronze, gold, copper. Oh, hold on. Medieval gold, luminescence gold. Holy smoky gold. Okay, hold on. I don't really. I'm not into these metallic -y colors. Warren Penny. Holy moly. Royal Ruby. Hold on. Rich Espresso. <laughs> this is cool because... Deco Art makes these, okay, bronze, copper, medieval gold, Warren Penny, Rich Espresso. Ooh, that's a cool idea. Luminescence gold. Okay, I have all those choices. Copper might be an idea. I've never really used copper. And it is a brown color, but let's see if it's too red. <laughs> Okay, let's see what we got here. Copper, copper, copper. And this is metallic. So, okay, and I'm, I, I need to worry about that a little bit later because um, I need to do the background. Oh, my God, I'm totally joining, drawing a blank, drawing a blank, drawing a blank. Okay, hold on. Let me move this over because I didn't use these paints at all. And I oh, you know what I might do? I might incorporate... No, that's too dark. Okay. This is really pretty ribbon. So who knows? That might end up making a... Okay. Dirty penny. It sounds, it sounds gross. Okay. Worn penny. Dirty penny. Okay. We might have to... You guys, I think I'm bringing the teal in here. And I know somebody's going to bust a gut on me. But you know what? I don't care. It can still be fall. No busting a gut on me. Okay, maybe I'll just go a little bit darker though. Maybe I'll do this one instead. Okay. Okay. And let me see, do I have a makeup sponge or something? I guess I could use this. So this is just a um, stipple brush and this is a um, crafter's workshop template and I'm not gonna go I don't know why I just envisioned these circles on it. Da -da. And I can go over it with black or. All 
I don't know where I'm doing it. Shoot, I wanted to be off the page. <laughs> Not even off the page. This is just, okay. Let's everybody say a prayer before I lift this up. Okay. Yeah, that's kind of what I wanted. Okay. All right. All right. Not perfect. Not crazy. Mm -hmm. Got to be careful when you lay it back down. Bringing the trash can up. Uh, you're bringing the trash can up? No, the trash cans just went down. So you can take two up tomorrow. The boys already did it. Thank you, though. Okay. Daily dollar short. Love a good, love a good helping hand. What is this? Oh, it's so good. Okay. Okay. Oh, <laughs> I guess I went right in the letters. Okay. Those are going to be covered up anyway. These, this brush kind of needs to be cleaned up right away. Always say that. Pretty much everything I use kind of has to be wiped up right away. Otherwise, I go kind of bananas. But no, a stipple brush does. Otherwise, it sticks all together and you can't run it underwater. And it's just a got to take care of it brush. Okay, cool. And I am going to take a paintbrush now and I'm going to kind of gesso over this. Um, Actually, I am going to gesso a little bit over these letters a little bit better because we're going to use a different color paint on it. I just want this to look very distressed. don't know where I'm going with it, but I'm sure something will come to mind. Right, right, right. Uh-oh. Problem, Houston. Kind of got to wait until that other color is dry. Cool. Still see it. Okay. Got it. Okay. Uh, yes, I will let you know what I'm using to clean that brush. It's Deco Arts Brush Cleaner. It's a liquid, and it works great. If I have a lot of stuff that I'm working on at one time, for example, like the templates and stuff, I'll actually have a cookie sheet with some water in that in it, and I always dump it. I put it in my, I put it in one this side where I scrub off my brushes and then I rinse my brushes over here. So it kind of keeps your brushes uh, alive and soft and all that other good stuff. Good question. Thank you. I caught a question. Okay. I think I'm going to have to put some brown to the letters somebody's suggesting because if I don't, um, I don't know that that paint will go through. So I'm going to use a little bit and then it's going to be yeah, it's going to make the copper pop. Good point. Loving it, loving it, loving it. Okay, we have to give this a dry. Otherwise, it'll be no good. Okay. Okay, so now I want to use a little bit of this around my perimeter of 
just going to bring a little bit of this. Oh, it's kind of a little ready red, but I got some brown that will go. Since we're shooting for the, since we're kind of heading toward that brownish look, I'm just going to distress the edges up. And this is this color, I don't know what color it is, but it's, oh, Copper Penny. Huh, isn't that funny? All of you guys saying copper, copper, copper. See, I was still able to make it look a little fall and still put some of my turquoise in it. <laughs> and I know that um, somebody asked me the other day to describe my style. I don't really know that I have one. I know that I tend to be clean and simple. If that is such a, oops, I should have opened. If you, if that is such a style. Um, I want some, I want some paint to be dripping down this. I don't want it to be so clean. I was thinking of a very darker or a bright orange. Is that going crazy, people? How, or how about, um, um, how about a, like, like a, oh, well, that might be too dark. I was thinking that it had to, oh, here we go. What about something, persimmons, clay, one of these colors. I wanted something that had the orange in it. Like this is cadmium orange, Georgia clay. Oh, what about persimmons? Let's try this. Okay. I encourage you, let me tell you, somebody just said, I have a stencil that's similar to that. I encourage you when you have something to use it. So don't go out and buy something. If it's close or you can make your own, I'm just crazy like that. So I'm gonna water this down. And then I'm gonna do this. Okay, people. Okay, people. Ooh, who said berry red? <laughs> I love it. People, who, who's that berry red? We're trying this first, but I love the thought of going. Okay, so this is, I watered it down. All right. And then I'm just taking the brush and I'm swiping it. I just want it to be, ah, out there. Ooh, ah. Uh. Oops, sorry. <laughs> Okay, and then we're going to help it down. <laughs> ah, hold on. I don't have enough hands. Hopefully, you're able to see what I'm doing. Giving it a little shove down the page. Yeah. And then wherever I don't want it, you can, you can steer it away. So if I want it more on the edges, which I kind of do. Okay, it's hard to hold it and get the water going down it. Okay. Mm -hmm. Hoo -hoo -hoo. Cool. And you're just spraying water on it so it'll dry. Okay, so let's shove that in there. Let's swipe this across so not everything. Um, these are these towels, by the way. I say this every week. I get them from Costco in the, I think it's the, like the men's shop. To, you know, like the, um, what do you call it? The, um, I don't know, like the uh, automotive section. And they're pretty much, see, I don't want that big blob right there. but so, Okay. So they're in the men's uh, like shop towel section in the automotive, and I think there are seventeen dollars for like fifty of them. And I keep them forever. If they get really bad, or if I'm spraying something on them that is just nasty, nasty, then I um, will throw it away. But I wash them in my whites, and yes, all my dust, and I use them to dust with. So <laughs> it's like when I'm dusting, I can see what colors I use that week. 
Okay. Getting pretty wet here, so let's wipe the bottom. Okay. And I use a boatload of them. Cool. It did what I wanted. Yeah, so I go to Costco and I... Get some of that water off of there. at Walmart. I mean, they're, they're just um, like terry cloth little towels. They're cheapies. Way cheapies. Uh, this is the color I used. I want to use like one more darker. Go oh, here about this one. Um, in fact, I have a whole new package of them because I use them around the house everywhere. So I'll do a load of them. Actually, I take that back. I wash them with my socks, too, and I know that's bad. <laughs> I wonder my socks smell like pine salt some days. Um, hold on. Looking for another brush. Nope, not that. Come on. Another brush. All right. I'm just throwing another splash of color on there. I almost like doing black, but I think that's a little too risky. Oh, that color was awfully like the last color. Oops. My screen just went off. Okay. Okay. We're feeling like fall now. Okay, at this point, I have to use a new rag because just shoving that around. All right, let's dry this baby off. <laughs> Ooh, we just said drop. Some of this blue, the blue that I use, let's do it. Let's try it. Look at me. Let's just do it. This is how we do it. I bought new brushes last week. Can you guys believe it, finally? Like two new brushes. Okay. Yeah, Andy is telling you, if you're not part of the Facebook group, please join us. I really wish I had a spray, and I think I do have a... Um, Ooh, this is cool. Ho, 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 This is what we needed, people. Who said that? Pam, you get the award for the night. I love it that this, you know, it's kind of, what you say, like a patina. Okay, hold on. If, if you're not seeing it, I do have to hold it up to a certain angle just to get it to run down the page. Okay. And then at some point, I probably should stop soaking this down so it doesn't turn into a giant sponge of... I really love... Okay. 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 There we go. I'm going to leave it. I wanted just simple, simple, simple. And now I am just going crazy, crazy, crazy. What do you think? It's, a, it's, it's layered. It's fun. I think when we get the... I have no idea how I'm putting the quote on there yet. Especially since I have to. Okay, I want it to dry like this. So we're just going to, if I have to throw more turquoise on it, I can. But I want it to dry like this. So let's get to it. Got to get the water on it. Or got to get the air gun on it. Whew. Okay. And I know, um, for those of you who are familiar or not familiar, I do share all of this, everything I've used. So I pull it all aside and I take photos of everything that I use and um, I use this, I use this, I use this, 
I use this, I use this, I did not believe use this. I do take photos and all the materials and everything I use the next day. So don't think you have to be taking notes. And is anybody taking my class tomorrow? That is, uh, for those of you who purchased the kit, I, you should have an email from me, by the way. And if you're still interested in buying the kit, uh, you can because I have to make five more tonight. <laughs> so I can make six, and you don't need it necessarily for the class because you can watch the recording, and then it's going to be uploaded to YouTube, and I have a password for those who purchased the kit. I'm doing that tomorrow night, and I'm so excited because uh, I had a really fun class last week with it, and I love teaching this class. It's a good one. I mean... No obligation, no nothing, you just... And if you guys have not... The other thing... Oh, this is really thick. Uh, if you guys have not seen the information on the cape, it is going on its journey tomorrow. I was due to mail it out today, and then the girl in San Diego who wanted it asked to come pick it up where I'm going to be tomorrow, so I coordinated with her. Sharon is getting it tomorrow, and she's all excited, so it's, it's on its way tomorrow. That's pretty dang cool. Oh, whoops. I want to wipe the pan. Trying to clean up a little bit because it's all wet. We're pretty stoked here. And you don't have to order the cake before tomorrow. I mean, you'll be able to do it. You can join in and everything. It's going to be fun. I think there's 20-some people doing it, I believe, is the magic number. I'm kind of excited because I don't really normally do, you know, hey, private. But I just decided that it was time to... Sorry, I'm going to run this paint a little faster. <laughs> I'm going to move it along. Okay. So the cape idea that we talked about, what, two weeks ago, I think, is already come to fruition and is being mailed out tomorrow. I thought that was such a cool, Every I think there's 40 people doing it so far. I will add people to the list in the midst of it. It's not a big deal, you know. And if it has to backtrack at some point, it's going to come back to me. Because I'm going to have Glue Dad and Glue Mom in the cape. Not at the same time. <laughs> ah, that's funny. Okay, what time is it? 6.42. i got to keep a time check, too. Just got to make sure we... Uh, probably Glue Dad will be fixing something or build, you know, doing something around here. Oh, that feels good. Okay, so this was pretty wet. If you wonder why I'm stabbing it with a heat gun so much, it's because we were really pretty wet. Okay, and somebody said they suggested I color this with a brown. I love that idea. So I'm going to go for that. How dark of a brown? A medium brown? A sienna e brown? How about a milk chocolate? Okay, what do you think, milk chocolate? All right, here we go. Well, we're going to try it anyway. Oh, God, saying chocolate makes me hungry for milk chocolate. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay, well, that's what it's going to be now. <laughs> Thanks, guys, if you steered me wrong. These are, these are so not colors. I cannot believe I'm using brown right now. I'm almost wanting to... <laughs> um, I'm almost scaring myself. Brown. I don't use brown. I just don't, generally. It's kind of a thing. I miss bright colors. I know what I like to paint with. Okay, we're going to have to dry this before we throw the, I think what you're saying though, the metallic is going to really pop on this. Oh, dark chocolate only? Should I have gone, oh, should I have gone darker? Hold on, I can. Oh, 
Or are you saying, look at there is, look, it's funny, there is a color called dark chocolate. <laughs> sienna brown, you guys. Oh, sienna e. Oh golly, I'm way behind. Hold on, I have siennas. I have burnt sienna. Okay. Pally could go for some dark chocolate. <laughs> So I have great news. The glue parents are due to be out sometime in, um, sometime. There we go. I put burnt sienna on it. There we go. Oh, shoot, shoot. Don't do that. Okay. That's okay. Um, my aunt and uncle, I'm going to take off, I think, the week of Thanksgiving. So we might not have a show that week. But um, I have family. My aunt and uncle are coming to stay for Thanksgiving. And for birthdays, and I'm super excited because my uncle turns 60 out here. And uh, so I'm going to take a week off and be with the fam. But I have great news. When the glue parents are here, we are no vacation time because the glue parents will be participating. Uh, they participate live from here. I love that. Be become it, They become um, more popular. My ratings go up, ironically, when they're here. I don't know why that is. Glue Dad is a favorite amongst you ladies. I know that. Okay, and I'm not trying for this to be perfect, so don't think I am. <laughs> perfect! And I can get it better with the... Okay. I gotta give this a good shaky shake shake. Where is that? Copper is. You guys say copper. Honey to reduce the waistline. Yuck, I hate honey. Really? What's it gonna reduce? Okay. You guys said copper. Oh. That is the most beautiful copper. It's all metallic. <laughs> Blue Mom is a favorite too. It's harder to get Blue Mom on the screen. She tends to be more of a behind the scenes kind of gal, but we'll get her on. We'll tell her. We need her stage presence. Okay. <laughs> okay, people. This is a absolutely gorgeous. I know you can't see it. But, oh, my, mm, 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 mm. okay. Oh, you guys were right, the sienna color. Okay. It's a metallic, um, golly, it's gorgeous. Okay. And I love it. My brown isn't all the way dry, of course. I'm speeding up the process because I don't am Miss Impatient Sue. It's gorgeous though. It is perfect. I'm glad I let you guys pick the show tonight. <gasps> Whoops. Let's not go off the page here. And I guess I could have glued these letters on later, but this just seemed like so much more fun to have to maneuver through. And then I have another little idea <laughs> rolling around in this head of mine. Yeah, so for the next couple of months, we're going to have family galore here. This starts my... Um, this is what happens when you live in California and your family lives in Michigan. They start booking trips in the winter. You want them to come out in the summer when the weather's gorgeous and you guys can all use the pool and go to the beach and it makes sense. But when your family's from the Midwest, they feel like it makes sense once they've, once they've seen like three months of um, constant clouds. And then they come out and they say, hey, take me to the beach. And you're like... Ugh. The only people that are on the beach are people from Michigan and Minnesota, and that's not me. So, uh, yeah, this starts my family. My aunt will want to go put her feet in the Pacific Ocean, and I will be like, you are the only person that is doing that. But I will take them, and I will do it. <laughs> and I will suffer going to the beach. No, I love going to the beach. 
oh, I can't wait to photograph this tomorrow. It'll be far more vivid for you to see the coloring, but I will hold it up. It is, it is definitely metallic and it is definitely copper and it looks like I actually, what is it like, I don't know, metalize this somehow. And it was just simple corrugated cardboard. And I'm glad I went and got to the cardboard itself because that made a difference. We would be talking boring, boring snoring. And I am really putting this paint on. So this is going to be a four day dry job. No. Okay. I really don't want this to be perfect and look what I'm doing. Okay. I hope there's no questions. I hope I'm still on. <laughs> I have not had one question texted to me. And if I have, the phone's on silent and I'm ignoring it. Okay. It really is pretty, though. I, I commend you all for telling me what to do. Okay. All right. It's on thick enough. Okay, that is really gorgeous. A little more paint and a little bit more around the corners. And, oh, I'm in my happy place. Okay. Yeah, oh, you know when you get going and you just don't want to stop. Okay, that's where I'm at. It's pretty, though. It's really pretty. And I don't, I just had an idea. Come in. Okay, I just had a little idea that hit my head. Just hit myself in the head. Oops, I'm putting my, let's see that brown over there. Okay. Nope, hold on. this could be better but all right I know this sounds crazy but bear with me oops hold on what am I do I have this really cool template and okay okay Formulated in my head. Oh, burnt umber. Okay, let's see what this color is. And you know what I have to do is protect my work surface because when this stuff, this is gonna. I'm using Lindy Stamp Gang, um, similar to like, um, similar to Tattered Angels Mists. I love them. I think they're great in color. I'm just protecting my work surface. Okay. Okay, here we go. Don't panic anybody. Hold on, I'm panicking. I say you're supposed to let it go. Let it go, I'm just checking the color. I didn't really. Oh, that's a really dark color. It's darker than what I thought it was gonna be. One second. Hang tight, it'll be worth it. It'll, it'll give you the ooh ah effect. No, don't drop it shuffle. No, 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 no. What color is that? Mystic. Ooh, this might be it. This might do the trick. Yeah, this is, I just want it to be faint. There goes my hands. Well, I'm definitely, I wanted this to be really faint. This is going to be faint, I think. Okay. Ooh, that's too faint. <laughs> well. Go back at it. At first you don't succeed, go back and do it again. Hold on. It's so light, but it did, it did give a beautiful little sheen to the thing. Okay, there we go. All right, so let's try this again. I'm going to go with the darker color. Maybe I should give this a little dry off. 
Well, my page is definitely glittering now. You definitely have a glittered page. So let's try this again. If at first you don't succeed, try and try again. Ready, ready, ready. I'm just drying off the template. Okay. Whoa. This page is like saying, I cannot take any more water, Tracy Ann. But you're going to have to. Uh-oh, which one did I... All right, here we go. I'm going to go faint. Oh, my hands are going to need a... Okay, please work. <laughs> I'm asking, I'm begging, and if you don't, I'm going to be mad. I just want the effect of the limbs. Eh, it's not fabulous. I thought it was going to be better. But the great thing is, I just wipe it off. You know what I'm going to do? I think I'm just going to do it with paint then. This template is so narrowy thin that it's just not... There's just a lot of detail to it that the mist is not showing up strong enough. All right, fine. I'll do it again. Okay. Let's do it again. You know what I almost want? You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to do this. Stipple, stipple. Stipple, stipple. And I really like that burgundy color, so that's what I'm going to... Or that... Do you think that teal color will look good? I have so many paper towels around here. I can't find my stipple brush. Stipple brush! Go dark! Somebody said go dark. Go dark, go dark. Whew! Okay. How dark? How dark is dark? Go dark. Go dark, they're saying. Okay, go dark. How about that dark chocolate I had out? Russet. Okay, here we go. I'm going to use russet. Copper? I don't know if I have copper. I have every color that deco art has. Let's put it to you that way. <laughs> okay. And this is what I'm going to do. I'm doing a very, okay, here we go. I think you guys were right. Darker is better. Oh, I'm going to throw a little bit of the blue right back in here. Okay. And if it doesn't work, I'll wipe it off again. You know what? I don't like it. But I thought of one other solution. Okay. <laughs> thought of one other solution. Hang tight. Believe me not. I just feel like it needs something in that corner. So here's one idea, and here's the other idea. You know, if I did prep work, I still wouldn't get this right. Okay, hold on. I have a, I have a backwards tree that I think will look great. It's the negative. Does that make sense? If I can't find it, then I can't do it. Oh, here we go. No, no, no. No, no, no. Uh, I could just do a big paint splotch. That might work. I know I have it. Everybody's saying, okay, what is everybody saying? Yeah, I'm getting a text, which means Andy's saying, forget it. Oh, Glue Dad had a good idea. What did Glue Dad say? 
black would work too or dark plum oh i love it no i love it oh they loved it some blue white will make a pop boo 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 what a glue dad say can somebody tell me and i'm looking for that template because if i do the negative of it i will get the tree limbs that i want or if i just stamp this i will get that hold on I'm throwing temp I'm throwing templates all over the floor now. I'm determined to find it. Okay, what was Glue Dad's idea? Because I can't see it. Andy, do you mind telling me? <laughs> Glue Dad was just saying, draw out your damn self. Oh, we have more. Okay, I know what I have and I can't find it, so. All right, well, I had an idea. What was the idea? Massage her? <laughs> I could put just put paint on the template. Put paint on the template. That's what everybody's telling me to do. <laughs> All right, here we go. This is what we're going to do. We're going to just blurb this thing with paint. <laughs> okay, ready? Let's just foam brush it on. Okay, dog, you cannot go outside right now. Okay. Good idea, people. I hope this works. I just think it'll look cool. And I'll just throw some of that on there. And, okay. Ready? Ready? We're going to pray and hope and hope and hope and pray. Everybody in prayer mode? Hold on. Time out. <laughs> okay. Okay, every, use the net. Yeah, yeah. Got it. Got it. Yep. Thank you. Thank you. Here we go. I hope this works. I hope it's dark enough. I hope, I hope, I hope. Okay. Okay. I got to pounce it down a little bit. Okay. Ready? Lift. No. <laughs> this is where my jelly plate comes in handy. Hmm. <laughs> Buggers. I know I have an idea, and I know it will work, but I don't like that one. No, it's just that uh, these ten these stencils just don't have enough grab to them and enough, unless I use a jelly plate, which, you know what? Hello, I have a jelly plate right here. Look at me. I'm determined to get this done. Jelly plate to the rescue. Okay. This is what happens when you're me. Ready? Light that up. Hope that's dark enough. I'm thinking maybe you guys are right on the color. So, so what do I do? Do I color it, then lay it down, and then do it? What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Hmm. Let's do that. Let's just do that. See how it works on the jelly plate, and then transfer it over. Ready? Let's see, people. If it transfers onto the jelly plate, we're good, I think. Nope. See? Too thin. That was what I was afraid of. Well, we tried. It's just too thin, I think. Let's try it for the sake of argument's sake. Put that baby down there. Okay. Lift it up. Uh, no. See? I don't like it. Okay. Ditch it. Ditch it. If doesn't work it doesn't work you can't do anything about it I do know I have another template somewhere that would probably answer my problem but okay and I don't really feel like messing up doing a whole jelly plate thing so I don't really like that anyway so ditch it I know there's an idea somewhere in here okay Let's get our work surface and put ourselves back in order, everybody. There we go. All right. Now, it's it's not a matter of putting more paint on that template. It's just such a narrow template that it just, uh, it will continue to kind of give me fits. So I don't really want to sit here and 
I have another template I could use. That's the only other thing I could think of would be to use this other template. But I know what I want done. It's just I want the negative of it. And I know I have another, I do, I know I'll get off air and I'll find this other template and then I'm going to be mad at myself. But there's no sense me sitting here looking through it. So I'm okay. If I find it, I'll do it. And then I'll just tell you guys what I did. But I don't want to sit here all night. And, and my hour is almost up. I'm at 7.04. So hold on. Let me get myself back together. I have templates to wash off. Okay. I'll do, I will tell you this much. This page is sparkling like you wouldn't believe, though. Okay. So let me give this a dry. Because we really have added so much to it. I know. The good thing is, the more I keep adding to this, the more it's just kind of adding to it. It's just I don't. I know that I promise you guys in an hour will be done, and that's what I intend to do. But you should see it glimmering. It's just now that the. That template just does not want to accept a lot of paint. I will tell you, this thing is sparkling clean now. <laughs> and I love that I'm just rubbing the heck out of everything off of it. Okay, here we go. It just needs something. I just don't know what it is. Natural scrub and be crazy. Yeah, I could put some regular leaves on it. Oh, I got an idea. Don't move, don't move. I do have it, I promise. I hope I didn't throw, oh, there it is. <gasps> yes. Ba da da da. <laughs> okay, what color should they be? I found it. <laughs> what color should my dark leaves be? Okay. Freehand branch and leaves. I got it. <laughs> oh, sweet. Okay. I am just going to do this. Found it. Here we go. Don't panic. Let's do this again. And I'm only going to add it. In, oh, boy, that's dark. Well, this is what I wanted. Oh, shoot. Oh, I'm scared. <gasps> okay. Oh, okay. I got it. I'm okay with that. Ooh, somebody said light avocado. I love that idea, too. Uh, I love the idea of mixing in a couple of colors. Uh, here we go. Light avocado, another one of my favorite colors. Okay. Okay. Whoever said that, you get, oh, yes. Okay. Okay. I found it. I found it. I found it. Rest assured, we're back on track, people. I just have to figure out how to get this template down because it's all dirty now. Okay. I just want it to wrap around a little bit. Oh, shit. Shoot. Sorry. Um... Okay. Oh. Don't fret. There's always a solution. No making mistakes. We got the best back on track. Okay. Cool. That was what I needed. And then I'm going to do one more that wraps around. Hmm. What do you think? Right about there? Yeah. Okay, that'll kind of frame the page in. Okay. Whew. We did it. We have a lot of layers on this baby. Okay. This is what I wanted. This was what this was what was in my brain. It just wasn't. <laughs> and 
and I'm using two colors. Okay, so if we don't have it, there we go. Cool. Cool. Do I need any more? Do I need any more? And then I can throw the paint. Okay. Ooh, somebody just, I love that idea too. Uh, I think I'm good. Okay. Cool. I do have to say, this does look, this is way out of the box for me, but this is what I say to do all the time, so I'm following my own little, hmm. Okay, and I'm done. <laughs> I just got to get the saying on there, which I will. Okay. Woo! Anybody wanting to take a breath or have a giant drink right now? Oh, that would be me. Okay. Wording in the middle. Yeah, my wording I was just going to kind of put right here, and I was. Oh, my God, look at my hands. Hi, time for a manicure. Okay, and what I was going to do is let me take a heat gun and see. Let the beauty of what you love be what you do. <laughs> Ooh, we're going over a little bit. Uh, hey, Tracy. <laughs> nice new hair color. Thank you. <laughs> oh, now did somebody say use some of the glitter paint over the top of this? Oh, this thing is glittering. Trust me. It is glittering. Okay. Can't do much if it's totally soaking wet, so I'm just... Oops, this is not quite dry, but oh yeah, yeah, not quite dry, and I'm totally okay. You know what I'm gonna do? <laughs> there we go. That's what I'm gonna do. Can I get enough color on it? Do it like that. Okay. There we go. <laughs> uh, okay. I have no idea how I'm going to let the beauty of what you love be what you do. That's what I'm going to do. I just have no idea how I'm going to do it now. I feel like I'm running out of ideas. Um, any ideas? Write this on. Oh, I hate writing. All right. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> Yvonne is on? Oh my god. Okay, so what I'm thinking is I am going to do some lines right in here. I'm just going to make my own lines up because at this point I can't sweat any more than I possibly have. Oh, I know what I'm going to do. Watch this. This is what I'm going to do. You know what? This is what I'm going to do, people. Watch this. You want lines? I'm going to give you lines. Okay, ready? Oh, I've... This will solve my line problem. Ready? Ready, ready, Freddy. You know what this is? Frog tape. Me and my freaking frog tape are so freaking happy. Okay. Okay? Watch this. You want a line? There's a line. Okay? Let's get another line. I'm using the straight edge. Don't ignore what I'm cutting, but I just don't want it to be that thick. Okay? Oh, look at this. I want, I'm finishing this page right now. Okay. I don't know how many lines, but I'm thinking at least three. Okay, so this is frog tape. And all this is doing is acting as my line. Because I don't really, I don't really want this to be all crooked and nasty. Now that I've worked this damn hard. <laughs> okay. So this is frog tape, and I'm, I'm just cutting it to use the line. Oh, I know this doesn't look like I'm relaxed, but I tell you people, I am relaxed. I'm so relaxed that I can't wait till we're done. No, 
Um, okay, so hold on, which one's the side I didn't cut? Okay, so here we go. That's where I'm going to do. And it is going to say, <laughs> shoot me, no, here it goes. It's going to say <sighs> cursive or print? I'm going to say cursive. Print, cursive, oh. <laughs> I was going to flat it on the computer, guys, but I have, uh, forget the quote. You guys, really? Forget the quote? You don't put a quote on it and leave it? Forget the quote. I have no ink in my printer. Forget the quote and I'm done? Cursive. Should I be done? I think I'm done. I love it. If you guys are saying I'm done, I'm freaking done. I will finish this if you guys say I'm done. I'm taking a vote. Done. Keep it going. <laughs> I don't think I've ever done something. Uh, I don't think I've ever done something where I didn't have a good quote on it or something. Sounds good. Be done to me. Yeah. Hey. Duh. Okay. I do have a word on it. I just, you know what? I do kind of feel like it's done. It's done. <laughs> oh, quote. Crap. How about right here? A little quote. How about I write it really small? <laughs> right there. <laughs> Let it go. Let it go. Stop. Don't. Oh, my God. I can't believe I'm so obsessed with this. Okay, I'm done. Let it go. <laughs> Leave it. It's perfect. Oh, my God. Is that what I was feeling today? Leave it. Let it go. I think I'm done, though. <laughs> See, that's what I think. It's missing something. How about really small? <laughs> How about let the beauty of what you love be what you do? Done? No. Leave. Leave the strips. Done. I'm not going to leave the strips. They were just going to be my lines. And I was going to put a little quote. What about a quote right there? <laughs> put it in the middle of a leaf. I can't put anything in the middle of the leaf. I can't. You mean make a leaf and put it on there? Oh, my God. You guys, I'm going to surprise you tomorrow. I know I say I'm normally going to get this done. The other option is stick it right here. The other option is stick it up my rear. No. It is done. It is done. It's done. It looks perfect. You guys are all going to get to, You're going to get on tomorrow and there's going to be. I just. It does look done. I just. I've never. <laughs> Lori is like, it is done. I'm going to put the word done on it. All right. Love says it all. Huh. I'll be dipped. All right. You people say it's done. It's done. Okay. It's done. I'm done. <laughs> Not touching it. <laughs> All right, I'm done. The show's over, people. Get move on. Go somewhere else. <laughs> okay, I'm coming back. We like the lie. Oh my god. I'll surprise you. I'll sit here and stare for the next 20 minutes. The lines were not going to stay. Those were just guidelines that I was going to use to write my quote out. And But I am thinking that if we think it's done, you know, love does kind of say it all. Hmm. Okay. Done. <laughs> right? <gasps> right says it all. Love says it all. Oh, my God. I don't know if I can. Go, Joe, please. Thank you. Love means letting this go. <laughs> okay, I'm done for the night. I can't think anymore. <laughs> okay, I'm done. I'm so done. I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> love spread it like butter love <laughs> I
I have never done a one word anything. <laughs> Love is letting it go. Love is walking away from it. does look pretty though. I do have to say that. And once it dries, and it is glittery heaven. Okay. You're going to be surprised tomorrow. You're going to log in and it says. <laughs> tomorrow you're going to log in and it'll be layered 10 times more. After I got done saying my style is simple, I'm now sweating. <laughs> yeah. Okay, it's done. Plus, I would be going over an hour and I can't do that. Okay. You guys, it looks like a bomb went off in here. There are templates laying everywhere. Oh. And by the way, if you need straight lines, look what I just found. Okay. <laughs> I'm done. Okay, so my challenge to everybody is do a project with one word. <laughs> Here you go, love. It should have said wine. Okay. I'm done. <laughs> Thank you for all the claps. Okay, no quote. Ready? Okay, are there any questions before I log off for the night? Don't forget, you have a couple more days to do the October challenge. Check in, uh, please go by Grumbacher and thank them. The prize is coming from them. And uh, go to their Facebook page. It's all, always awesome the next day when a company says, oh, great, great, great. And also, what else was I going to say? Uh, um... Oh, the November calendar will be out soon, and I'll be announcing the new um, sponsor. I know. Everybody should. This is. I can't practice what I preach, and I have to go on and on and on and on and on. But I rarely do do weird, just one word. And if I get off this and find that stupid tree template, I'm going to go crazy. All right. <laughs> I challenge you all to do a one word, uh, God, if I would have known that, I don't think I would have picked love. I would have picked something else like create or something. <laughs> Made me pick a word that I didn't even want to use. Thank you so much. Okay. I am, <laughs> does anybody feel like after they're done, they actually need a rest from me? <laughs> Oh, is it somebody's birthday? Oh, you're so welcome. I'm so happy that you all tuned in. And remember, uh, this week's challenge is a one-word layout with anything you want, as many layers as you want. And if you put a tree on there, I'll kill you. No. <laughs> all right, I'm throwing this away. Ready? Going away. <laughs> oh, you might just I never need a rest from you. I need a rest from me. I know what I'm having tonight. Woohoo! Clink. Okay, so everybody, I now say it is thank you to my moderators uh, and for all three of them for texting me. I have, I'm taking a picture, by the way, and sharing this. On, I, I did do it without a tinkle break. I'm taking a picture of what has become my workspace because there is paint on the floor. There is everything. So tonight you'll see what the behind the scenes looks like in my studio. Okay. That's what I'll share. And thank you for giving me back my mojo. I have not felt great creatively in a while. And now I just feel like I got a bit of my spirit back. And I'm happy about that. So we're back on next Monday. And uh, everybody needs to just, in the meantime, do a one word. And if you share it with me, it'll go on my website. Uh, I will do a blog post of all your, just give it to me in one word. I'm going to dedicate this to you guys tomorrow. Give it to me in one word. Oh, what a bomb this is going off. I'm trying to clean it up. All right. Uh, <laughs> and yes, I made it without a tinkle break. Go, for, go me. Okay, so everybody use one word. And please make sure it's not a bad word, okay? You should see the mess I have. Okay, I'm out of here. I'm going to turn off the record, but I'm still staying here because it keeps me on. I love this land. <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.